Hi, I'm Laura Conley, fur bear and black bear biologist with the Missouri Department of Conservation, and I would like to inform you about Missouri's upcoming black bear hunting season. Black bears were historically abundant throughout the forested areas of Missouri prior to European settlement, but large-scale habitat changes and unregulated harvest drove their numbers very low. Over the last 50 years, bear numbers in the Missouri Ozarks have been increasing. From 2010 to 2021, Missouri's bear population grew from around 350 bears to around 800. Bear numbers are currently increasing each year and bear range is expanding. Given our flourishing bear population, MDC established a limited and highly regulated bear hunting season. The hunting season provides Missouri residents the opportunity to participate in the sustainable harvest of a valuable natural resource. Today I would like to discuss some important regulations related to the bear hunting season. These regulations include black bear hunting season dates and limits, hunting methods, black bear management zones, black bear hunting permits, and the permit application process. The timing and length of the season, restrictive methods, and permit allocation coupled with a harvest quota have been established to ensure a sustainable harvest of our growing bear population. In doing so, not only will Missourians have the opportunity to hunt this native species, but will also ensure bears persist as a valuable part of Missouri's biodiversity. The black bear season begins the third Monday in October and will end after 10 days or until the zone-specific harvest quota is achieved, at which time the season will close, whichever comes first. Black bear management zone-specific harvest quotas are established annually by the Conservation Commission. There's a one bear bag limit and hunters are allowed to use archery, excluding LL, or firearms. The use of bait or dogs is not allowed at this time, but may be reevaluated if management needs change in the future. Bears primarily occur along and south of Interstate 44, therefore Southern Missouri is divided into three black bear management zones, or BMZs. These zones divide areas of bear habitat and are bounded by major roadways. BMZ-1 occurs in the southwestern part of the state, south of Interstate 44 and Highway 60, and has high-quality bear habitat where bears have been established for many years. BMZ-2 occurs in the southeastern part of the state and encompasses the largest tracts of Mark Twain National Forest and includes substantial areas of high-quality bear habitat. BMZ-3 occurs in the central part of Missouri and surrounds areas such as Lake of the Ozarks and Truman Reservoir. And while bear numbers are low in this zone, they are increasing into areas of suitable habitat. A black bear hunting permit costs $25 for successful applicants who are randomly drawn for a permit. Permits must be used within the designated BMZ and can be used on public or private property. Black bear hunting permit numbers for each BMZ are approved annually by the Conservation Commission. Only Missouri residents are eligible to apply for a black bear hunting permit within a specific BMZ, and there is a $10 application fee. Permit applications are available May 1st through 31st each year, and permits are awarded by July 1st each year. Residents are allowed one application per year, and there is no sit-out period for applicants. To ensure resident landowners have an opportunity to participate in the season, a minimum of 10% of zone-specific black bear hunting permits are randomly awarded to eligible resident landowners within the specific BMZ. To qualify, an individual must own 20 contiguous acres within the BMZ they are applying for and must have previously submitted a landowner permit application. This is the same application that is used to receive deer and turkey landowner permits. For more information on black bears and additional details on the hunting season, visit these websites.